Mr. Chairman. <coughs> Mr. Chairman. Uh, who seeks recognition? Yes, sir. I have a resolution to offer, and uh, it has to do with uh, validating the wishes of the through this caucus. Yeah, your resolution is out of order, sir. We are. Okay. Would you would you please inform me when it is when that resolution would be in order? Point of order, Mr. Chairman. Uh, point of order is heard. State point of order. Uh, the body was convened this morning for two purposes: to elect slates of delegates to go to the state and the district convention, and for the purpose of amending the draft uh, platform of the Republican Party to go to the state convention. There is no mention in the rules of anything other than that, including resolutions. If this body were to act on this motion to adopt a resolution, we would be operating outside of the rules of the call to convention, and everything we do today could be thrown out at the next level. We would be wasting our time, and I, uh, I oppose this, uh, this motion on the grounds that it is outside of the bounds of the call to convention. All right, the point of order is well taken. Your, your uh, offer of a resolution to change the uh, and, and ladies and gentlemen, uh, this gentleman has uh, spoken to me before the meeting convened, so I have a sense of the gist of the resolution, and it is it would effectively alter the rules uh, established by the state uh, committee and expressed in the rules uh, the call to convention. Such, such an amendment of the rules stated in the call to convention would be out of order. I have a point of information then. State your point of information. This convention or caucus can uh, exact exactly what it wants to out of the outside of the rules if the rules are changed. It can change the rules. And also, it's uh, a point of information that I think everyone here needs to hear. Sir, uh, you've not stated a point of information, and you are out of order. Okay. You want me to state this as a point of information? No. no. I, would take that, I would take that as a prejudicial opinion. Uh, you might consider offering this as an amendment to the state party platform, which would be in order at a, uh, at a later point in this caucus. Well, this point of information affects the vote of every single person here. That's the reason why it is important. And if you continue to deny it, I will ask that it be formally placed in the records of this caucus by the secretary so that it be, can become public knowledge. We do not want to invalidate the vote in the primary of the people of this county, and that is what is going on. That is exactly what is going on here. The people of this county voted for Donald Trump in a majority. And I don't want any of my imaginations to interfere with that. And I don't think these people do either, no matter who they're for.
I would like to move to remove the chair. Make a move. Remove the chair. Remove the chair. Deception. He's arbitrary. Nothing but deception. Obamacare. Vote for it. You don't even know what it is. He's not fair. Excuse me, Mr. Chair. Excuse me, sir. I stood when you asked. Sir, we were very wrong here, sir. I stood when you asked for people to speak in opposition of that slave. They have to address this. Thank you. 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 Three minutes for words and three minutes to go. I know that gentleman will not take three minutes. Per person. That is per person. We were told and we were told that they would hold up a yellow sign and then we were told they would hold up a red sign here to stop disinfecting. Oh, yeah. 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 Ladies and gentlemen, the choice will be presented. You vote for the slave or against it. If you're for Trump, vote against it. If you don't yeah. like the slave, if you're for Trump, remove the chair. Remove the chair! 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 Possibility of a hijacking was pretty high, and that's why I stuck to the agenda. Well, I mean, the vote would have, would have determined who would have been the chair. Yeah. Yeah. Well, okay. But then, if, if you presume that, then it was a waste of time. But you, you doing that, I think you would have saved a lot of face if you just allowed the vote. You probably would have won it. Instead, it looks like. Really yeah. Okay. Well, it, so I've been accused of that once or twice. Now that since you ignored the call for your own removal, doesn't that call into question everything after that point? No, it doesn't. <laughs>